All right, what is up, boys and girls? Welcome back to another video. As always, thank you very much for joining me. I am Crypto Maximalist. Make sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel. Before we begin, I've got an amazing giveaway for those who sign up to buy a bit down below using my link. I partnered with them to offer a free $500 trading position on their platform to do with as you choose. If you sign up in the next 70 days using my link down below in the description and deposit $100, I've personally used it to take a 3x leverage long on Dogecoin. And if it hits $1, I'll make around 15 k for free, which is absolutely insane. So definitely worth checking out if you want to get into the markets. We're taking a look at very VeChain then on our daily time frame. As we could see, continuing to chop sideways in line with what Bitcoin's been doing. Bitcoin re getting rejected in and around its all-time high, obviously leading to the bleeding of the altcoin market. This is nothing new. If you don't know this by now, quite frankly, you haven't been paying attention because it's pretty obvious that every single time Bitcoin goes sideways or down, we do see altcoins getting bled to death. And you can see that's what's been happening to VeChain over the past six, seven, eight months now. Massive first wave of the bull market and then bleeding as Bitcoin has been going sideways, basically. Bitcoin's pretty much still at all-time highs. And we've got VeChain here, basically down a massive amount from its local swing high and nowhere near its all-time highs, which says everything you need to know. Overall, the macro is still looking really good for me. One, two, three, four, five waves to the upside, heading towards $1. That's what I'm looking for in this cycle. Right now, VeChain gearing up for the next third leg. To the upside, in my opinion, Bitcoin near its all-time highs and ready to break out. If that's the case, we will be seeing VeChain head to the upside as well. You can see VeChain here very clearly in a big descending wedge formation. We've got a few breakouts now of this area. And really, I would say this is the break and retest of that resistance now. You can see really all that we've been doing over the past two or three months is going sideways. Not too much to report. Every single time that we do get a little bounce to the upside, Bitcoin has been getting a rejection and dragging the market down. But it's not going to happen for much longer. We are going to get that breakout and that next leg up in the markets. It's eventually going to come. It's just a matter of time, not a matter of if, in my opinion. You can see VeChain here basically looking like it's gearing up for that next move to the upside. Doing something like this going into the bull market proper. I think it's going to be happening soon. Bitcoin's obviously going to head towards 100k and beyond soon, leading the market up. Right now, VeChain basically just chilling and waiting for that to happen. Going sideways while Bitcoin chops around and makes its mind up. Not much to report. Other than that, we are going sideways still. Going up and down, really, in a bit of a range. Anywhere from around that 2 cent level up to around 2.7 cents. Under that 023 Fibonacci. But apart from that, not much to report. Just chilling and waiting. Make sure to sign up to buy a bit and get your 30k bonus down below. Massive prizes at the minute for depositing $100. Bitru are also offering 50 USDT for depositing or if you're looking for a non-KYC self-custody exchange for trading. Alpharex down below in the description as well. And like and subscribe for more.